Welcome guys, um, this is Sina, welcome to Machine Learning Mindset. In this tutorial, I am going to give you a um, warm-up about um, TensorFlow. Actually, here you are going to learn how to import TensorFlow and some specific um, commands that helps you get started with TensorFlow. I just provided this um, notebook for you and you can see the link in the description as well. Let's go ahead and get started. So here the first thing we are going to do is importing tensorflow as tf which is going to be our placeholder for tensorflow to check the version of the tensorflow um, the version of the installed tensorflow we use tf dot underline the line version underline underline so this is going to be the command that we use for check the version and then we are going to see if tensorflow is built by cuda so the function is very simple tf test does is built with CUDA let's go ahead and search this function so you have an idea what it does okay this is the function as simple as that there are aliases for the function tf compact version 1 test is built with CUDA simple if it is correct if the CUDA is enabled by tensorflow it's going to we are going to have a true as the output if not then we are going to have a false then the next step I'm going to show you how to list all the physical devices that are available and if you're only interested to list the GPU devices you can use tf.config.list physical devices let's go ahead and search this function as well so here's the function the device type uh, by default is none which returns all the devices and um, actually um, when we have actually some sort of um, other notebooks here the reference by tensorflow as well if you're only interested in the gpus we are only um, actually getting the gpu devices that they have gpu in their name so this is how i'm listing this is how i'm listing all devices on the gpu later on i'm going to use some mathematical operations on tf tensors in another tutorial we are going to talk about the tensors but for now just let's take a look at this tf.normal tf.random.normal um, which creates Gaussian um, distributed um, tensors so I will actually normal distributions so it's going to be by default defined by tensorflow we have the shape as the first um, argument by default has mean 0 and a standard deviation of 1 which is the normal distribution and there are other variables that you can check um, the descriptions on the official website of tensorflow so now we are going to have a 1 by 10 TF um, actually tensor which has normal distribution and we are going to have the reduce sum this function is going to take the sum along some axes which we don't when we um, actually don't specify the axis is actually going to take the sum over everything um, in this um, tensor so we are going to run this this is Google Collaboratory, so um, I recommend you to use it because it gives you free GPU access and a lot of packages are already installed inside that. So let's just run it to see what we get there as the output. So here it is, the TensorFlow version 2.3, CUDA is available. These are the name of the devices. and This is the TF Reduce Sum Tensor as the output. Okay, this was a warm-up and a start on TensorFlow. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, thank you so much for your attention. Feel free to ask questions or leave a comment below. Thank you so much and see you soon.